trials just trying to represent the brand and showcase our products. Over the top of everything we will have Bayer Crop Science Chemistry where there too we can look at what options we have for onions or sugar beets or, or corn or what have you. So all those factors will be here uh, doing demonstrations throughout the year. I am sitting at our first demonstration for DeKalb and that is planting depth study. Uh, I've done this study for many many years and you probably have seen it already but Basically what I have here is uh, over in this row is planted at one inch. This row is at two inches deep. This row three inches deep and this row at four inches deep. And basically what we're looking for is what depth, planting depth, do we get the best stand? You know, it's very important to get that corn up in less than say 17 days to get a very good viable stand that's gonna make us some money. Year after year, uh, I've been doing this, and I can tell you between two to three inches, so two, two and a half inches is where I plant my plot. So this plot, I planted a strong two inches, almost two and a half inches. Uh, that's where I plant all my stuff. I never, ever plant corn shallower than an inch and a half. I want to be in that consistent moisture, that consistent temperature. Uh, shallow planted, I can see up at an inch. Uh, maybe it's warmer during the day, but it's colder at night. So ups and down swings is never good. Uh, this plot was planted in absolutely perfect condition. Uh, very good. If anything, it was just possibly just a touch too wet. Uh, so very, very good condition. When we got this planted, the conversation was, is all the one inch stuff will be up in a couple days. And, and I said, no, uh, two inch will be first, three inches will be second, four inches will be next. And then the, the one inch stuff will be coming up here and there for the remainder of the summer. So we did this plot. And then I put a time-lapse camera on the front, and, and so you can see exactly where uh, what came up. Me. I was here uh, a couple days after I put up the camera just to kind of see how things were looking, make sure the camera was working. The two inch stuff was up about, oh, three quarters of an inch to an inch and a half, just a little spike coming out of the ground. The three inch stuff was up about a half to three quarters of an inch of a spike coming out of the ground. So it probably came up about a half day later. <coughs> the four inch stuff was just barely peeking out of the ground, not all of them just a few spikes peeking out of the ground and the one inch stuff uh, was nowhere to be seen. <coughs> now after about a week coming back and looking at it, uh, the one inch stuff is basically got one plant up, very erratic, uh, it's just a disaster. Two inch stuff is by far the most consistent, nicest looking stand. Uh, really, really came up nice. Uh, very few immature or weak, weaker uh, plants, very even right there. When I look at the three inch planted depth, uh, this one has got, compared to the two inches, I can find two less plants. So two less plants came up and I've got a couple more runs or smaller plants. So not quite as good as the two inch stuff was. When I get to the four inch stuff, I have two more missing. So from two inches to four inches, I'm sitting at about three missing plants. So I lost another plant and there are a couple more uneven ones. So and I think usually between the two and the three inch comes out to be the most consistent and, and nicest looking ears. So again, I think this year it's going to be two to three inches is where we want to plant. Uh, definitely two inches has my best early stand. And we'll take a look at the film and see, see where it is at. Uh, hopefully it turned out. Sometimes that time lapse camera isn't all that it's cracked up to be. So we'll take a look at it. We'll post it on the video and you can see what it looks like for yourself. With that said, August 29th, we are going to have a, a field day here at the 
Fayette location where you can come and see this this particular plot and, and several others. So hope to see you in August and have a good day and stay 